Bonnie Mbulai slams Clifton Beach racial incident. Bonnie Mbulai says that the city of Cape Town need to check themselves. Bonnie Mbulai has added her voice to the outcry over an alleged racial incident at Clifton Fourth Beach in the Western Cape recently. Fatima Shabadian and ANC Western Cape Provincial Secretary Faiz Jacobs and his family were among those booted off the beach this week by a private security company. They were allegedly also told that the beach was closed. A fees must fall branch in the Western Cape saw it as a racial incident and have called for all self-respecting to descend to Clifton Fourth Beach on Friday to reclaim our beaches from racists. The security company said it was helping the city reinforce safety and control after an alleged attempted rape on the beach, but the city of Cape Town has distanced itself from the company. The incident has sparked fierce debate on social media and on Thursday afternoon Afternoon Express presenter Bonnie Mbulai stepped in to give her thoughts on the matter. In a series of posts, she claimed the city was trying to parade an image of white hegemonic paradise to attract tourism. As a tourist attraction, Cape Town wants to be able to parade as a white hegemonic paradise where folk like Adam Katsavlos can take selfies on the beach and claim there are no, K-word, in sight, probably part of the city of Cape Town's scramble to recover their tourism deficit caused by drought. She said that even a denial by the city would not fix the perception that they were against people of color going to certain beaches. Even if the city of Cape Town walks this back and releases a statement denying their involvement, they know the damage is done. The message is spreading and the die is cast, that if you're a person of color, you will not be allowed on the beach. If anything, it has worked as an intimidation tactic. Bonnie said the situation was a mess and an attempt to separate people. Her anger was shared by 5FM DJ Rob Forbes who claimed the city was tone deaf.